Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Katya. For those of you who do, welcome back. So for today's video, I thought it would be fun to do a wall art DIY for you. I was looking at my dining area and I felt as though it was not cohesive with the rest of my house. I felt that the dining room was looking a little flat and dark versus the rest of my living area. I was looking at it and I couldn't figure out what it was. I had put a light carpet on, there was my wood things, I had brought in a little bit of black, put a little bit of ivory on the table, but there was something that I was not feeling and it came to me. What was bugging me was the wall art. I think that that was what was creating the darkness there, the heaviness. So what I wanted to do is bring a little bit of light and zhuzh it up a little bit and make it blend properly with the rest of the living space. If you're like me, I love to change things up, give it a whole different vibe, a whole different mood. And that's exactly what I wanted to do to my dining area. So I thought creating a wall art with linen fabrics. And if you've been following me for a while, you know that I love patchwork stuff. So I thought that that was a great way to create a simple yet unique wall art, but something that if I want to change my furniture up, if I want to change the decor, I can totally do that, but keep the wall art for a little while. That was my goal. I wanted to create something that was simple enough to blend in with different styles and different looks. I'm super happy of how they turned out. I love them. I feel that they make such a difference and I cannot wait for you guys to see them. So anyway, without further ado, we're going to jump right into this DIY. Enjoy. Now this is the artwork that I have hanging up on the dining room wall. I am feeling that it's a little too cluttered. I loved it at a moment and now I'm a little bit over it. So I'm gonna take those down and I wanted to do something a little bit less dark and a little bit lighter, bring a little bit of brightness there. And because of the window here, I feel as though there's always a reflection. I'll go on the other side and show you. There's always a reflection in the frame. You never see the artwork unless you're on this side here. So that too has been bothering me. I don't know if you guys are seeing the reflection, but when I do it this way, you can barely see the artwork when you come in. So I'm going to start working on the new artwork, but I wanted to show you what I have going on right now so you can see the little before and after. So this is what I mean by the glare. There's like a little glare in the glass and it has been bothering me ever since I put those up. So I want something with no glass. I'm gonna keep the frames. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with them yet, but we're gonna put them in storage for now. I wanted to show you from this side.
that is it guys i hope you enjoyed this diy comment down below let me know what you think let me know maybe what you would have done or maybe some changes that i can do for my next video i recently also was doing a whole revamp on my shelves so comment down below let me know if you guys want to see the whole process of me just changing things up once i'm done with something i feel as though i have to refix it again because i get fed up very easily so comment down below let me know if you guys are interested in seeing that thank you all so much for watching thank you for all your thumbs up your comments you guys already know how much it means to me i am just so grateful and i love you so so much and i will see you in my next video bye guys Mwah.